You need to pay attention to brainstorm trading on NASDAQ under BCLI being a biotechnology company developing innovative autologous stem cell therapies for highly debilitating neurodegenerative diseases such as amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, multiple sclerosis, and Alzheimer's disease. Brainstorm Cell Therapeutics has made significant progress in its development of neuron, an investigational therapy for amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, ALS. Key Achievements 1. FDA Alignment Received alignment with the FDA on the CMC aspects of its Phase 3B clinical trial for neuron. 2. Our SPA Agreement Obtained an SPA Agreement from the FDA, validating the clinical trial protocol and statistical analysis. 3. CRO Selection Selected a leading CRO to support the initiation and execution of the Phase 3B trial. 4. Trial Site Establishment Actively engaging with over 12 leading ALS centers of excellence to establish trial sites. 5. Manufacturing Progress Manufacturing processes are well advanced and on track to meet production timelines. 6. Positive Biomarker Data New biomarker data from the prior Phase 3 study and EAP suggest continued benefits for patients receiving extended treatment with Neuron. 7. Publication Phase 3 biomarker data on Neuron and ALS were published in Muscle and Nerve. Corporate Updates 1. Successful Direct Offering Completed a successful registered direct offering, raising gross proceeds of $4.0 million. 2. New appointments appointed Hartoon Hartoonian as EVP and COO and promoted Dr. Bob Dagger to EVP and CMO. Financial results. 1. Cash position. Cash, cash equivalents, and restricted cash amounted to approximately $3.65 million as of June 30th, 2024. 2. Reduced expenses. Research and development expenses and general and administrative expenses decreased compared to the previous year. 3. Net loss. Net loss for the second quarter ended June 30, 2024 was $2.5 million compared to $5.3 million in the previous year. Recently, the CEO Chaim Lebovitz gave insight saying, We continue to make excellent progress in our preparations for the planned Phase 3B trial of Neuron in ALS, with important recent developments on regulatory and operational fronts. We believe that the regulatory aspects of the program have been substantially de-risked, having secured agreement with the FDA on a special protocol assessment and also reached alignment on the CMC aspects. We have selected a leading clinical research organization and are actively working to establish multiple trial sites. If successful, this trial has the potential to significantly improve the lives of ALS patients by providing a much-needed therapeutic option.